so important. No, okay, who wants to start? <laughs> Neil, yeah. I was searching my missus, to be honest, she was there somewhere in between, and I was just wanted to make sure she's still fine. <laughs> um, no, it's it's come on, I think it's not it's not to celebrate something, it's just to, to, to show appreciation, to, to, to say thank you and go there. And um, I think the support was again incredible. Um, we could calm down the city ground slightly with the football we played in moments, but there were other moments when they, when they were really on their toes, so I liked the game atmosphere-wise as well. Um, yeah. Um, it's nothing changed really. So you play 95 minutes, incredibly intense football, and you are as smart as before. Um, but that's actually pretty good news. We are, if we win today, what would have been possible, but it would have been possible as well that we lose. Um, so if you win today, we are two points up. That would change nothing. Um, we have to be nearly perfect to to beat this team in a game, but over a season as well. So. Um, yeah, let's see. Sorry. No, no, I didn't find her, but she was there. I heard so. All good. Okay, Paul Joyce. Yeah, yeah. Can, were you were oh. you unhappy um, at half time? Happy or unhappy? Unhappy with, with aspects of the first half. As not unhappy, but I knew we can improve. So, but it's not that I went in and said, how can we do that? I know how intense that is. The, the, the concentration level in these games, it's incredible, to be honest, because it's really, I said now a couple of times, like two boxers, and in the moment, two heavyweights, in the moment when you put your arms down, you get such a knock in the middle of your face, and then you have to, to get up again, and then you have to, to try to, to get control again, and that's what happened. So what we said in halftime, actually what we said before the game already, it's the way we had to defend, that we have to be there more um, braver in these moments. So Hendo did exceptionally well stepping up in this situation. When we didn't have that, when we didn't have, um, we couldn't put pressure on the, on, the, on the ball, then we were too high. So, but not too, too high, like in saying too high, the timing of their runs was outstanding. And that's why it was really tricky. But I liked a lot, and that's what was actually the main message in half time that uh, when we control the game, we cause them more problems than ever before in games. And that's really good. And um, so we improved, obviously, in this department, and it's absolutely it's good, good news for us. But of course, I would have loved it, would have done it more often, because like the, like the football situation around the goal, when we scored the first goal, and when we scored the second goal, both like just top awareness and go there, top finish, all these kind of things. So, and then we had 15 minutes where we were clear, uh, clear, kind of in control, but then they got momentum back. And it's, it's just um, both teams you could see, both wanted for a minute or two, take a deep breath and then go again. So, massive game. Okay. Oh, again. Um, Hi. It, it seemed like City played a lot like Liverpool in that game. <laughs> what, what did you think? You're welcome. We don't we don't own the style, so it's fine. It's so different for City, though, isn't it? They don't, they don't normally. It's just smart. It's just smart. It's not a, who cares. City is allowed to play balls behind the line. When you have the runs, they have. I have. I, I couldn't respect it more. <laughs> Kevin De Bruyne. He, so like that. It's it's easy to play. The, sorry, it's easy to play the pass, but the timing they had for their runs was absolutely. It's not bad to be honest. I, I, I like that. Um, yeah, we could have done it as well, but we were in the playing mood today. <laughs> so, but it was, it's fine, really. As I said, we, we improved, and it's about winning football games, and not about um, showing up um, which style you uh, want to push through, like um, really stubborn. Um, and yes, there were moments more direct than usually, but I thought it was a good idea. What did you mean by you playing? We played much less long balls than we usually do. So we wanted to play between the lines, through the lines, and these kind of things, just because you control it. It's the, the last line of City defense uh, balls about really well, 
uh, really, really together, really have all physical, physically they're quick and all these kind of things. So we want to mix it up, but um, actually the plan was um, to play. And uh, how we did around it, it, look, the first goal we scored was now, we scored similar goals against City. I'm pretty sure there was one goal um, when it was a away game here as well. I think in the end we lost 2-1. Uh, when Bobby Firmino scored after Trent Cross and Robo heads the ball square. Um, we had the ball before that, I think, 25 or 30 times past the ball. Not that often today, but it was a similar goal. So that's what we want to do, that's what we have to do. No team in the world is perfect, we are not. City is probably the closest, but it's not perfect as well. Um, and so we have to try to, 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 to force them to make um, a few little mistakes. Do you agree with um, Pep that it will take seven out of seven to win the title for either yeah. of these teams and that you, you're basically looking for perfection from here? Yeah, I think that's probably right. Um, I mean, I always said nothing changed for us. It was before we, we knew it in January. We knew in January if we want to if we want to win it, we have to we have to win 18 games. So now, and if there's one we can draw. Sorry, it was today. We drew. Um, now let's see. We have the next. We have now two massive games for us. We have um, Benfica on, on on Wednesday and um, Wednesday, yeah, and then City again on Saturday. And after that, it really starts. Um, we have to we have to be ready for our derbies. And um, yeah, but it's actually cool. It's good. Fine. We are we are where we want to be. We are we are close to. To an incredible side, um, my boys showed today that we are really, really good as well. And I said now a couple of times, if you is it allowed to say screw you? Is it allowed yeah, to say? That's, okay. that's allowed. Good. If you don't have luck in life, you're screwed. That's how it is. And we have no. And that's how it is. And we have the we have the situation that um, we had a situation three years ago, one point behind. It was not a point. It was actually millimeter, 17 here, and I think 15 at Burnley. That's the situation, if, and you, you cannot. You have, you, have, you have no influence on that. Huh? So we all know situations. We need to have. We need to. I don't think luck with ref decisions, but at least right decisions. So all these kind of things. And you can, that's then something we don't have. We can't influence. What we have to be, we have to be pretty much as close to perfection as somehow possible to win seven. Premier League games, which is absolutely insane, but that's obviously the only way to beat this team. Okay. If it's enough, because we don't know that if they've been them as well, then it's difficult. Okay. Well, last questions about that. Can you obviously uh, appreciate you know you and Pep are winners? You, 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 both of your teams are. Can, can you actually enjoy the moment out there, or is it just so intense no. that, that you can't? Oh, it's now not that I that the, the main mood is joy, but um, yes, I enjoy absolute moments. Uh, absolute. So we, um, I can really I respect a lot what they are doing. So I, even I can enjoy something like that, especially when they don't score with it. But then I see the pass and I see the run and I think, wow. It's really strong, and because for me it's important. Could we have done something differently in that moment or not? Because the information I have to give my players are, they should better be spot on. Otherwise, you the players think, what are you talking about? So yes, I can enjoy moments, but it's not the general mood. It's yeah. it's work. Because I, I might have dreamt it, but I'm sure you hugged each other, you and Pep, in about the 83rd minute or something like that. Not just at the end of the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. About it. I I no, 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 I forgot what we were talking about. It was not a proper hug. It was more a slap on the shoulder or something like that. But it was fine. Nothing, no argument, nothing. But I forgot what it was about. Thank you very much, everyone. Thank you.